In this video, I'm going to show you how to build a beautiful, high-converting landing page for your Shopify store without needing to touch a single line of code. We'll be using a tool called Instant. It's a drag-and-drop page builder that works directly inside Shopify. It's perfect if you want more control over your page layout, branding, and content than what the default Shopify editor allows. By the end of this tutorial, you'll have a custom landing page that looks professional and is optimized to turn visitors into customers. Before we dive into building the store, the first thing we need to do is sign up for Shopify. To make things easy and to support the channel, just head over to ecomsensei.com Shopify. This is my affiliate link, and it gives you a special offer. A free trial, plus your first three months of Shopify for just $1 a month. Once you're on that page, enter your email, click Start Free Trial, and follow the steps to set up your store. Shopify will ask a few basic questions about your business. Just answer what you can, and then it'll drop you right into your dashboard. Next up, we need to install the Instant Sections and Page Builder app. That's the tool we're going to use to actually design and publish the landing page. From your Shopify dashboard, Look at the menu on the left and click on Add under the Apps section. Now, here's a quick heads up. Instant might not appear in the recommended apps list, and that's totally normal. Just scroll to the bottom of the page and click on Shopify App Store. That'll open the official App Store in a new tab. In the search bar at the top, type Instant. You're looking for the one called Instant Section and Page Builder. Click on it, then hit the Install button. Right after that, you'll be redirected back to your Shopify dashboard. Click Install again to confirm the app. Instant will then prompt you to either sign into your existing account or create a new one if you don't have one yet. Just follow the quick steps. It only takes a minute to set up. As soon as you're in, you'll land on the Instant dashboard. This is where all your page projects live. Go ahead and click New Project. Now, you'll be asked to name your project and select your industry. For this tutorial, I'm going to call my project Cairo Landing Page. Let's say we're building a page to sell minimalist watches built for everyday confidence and timeless style. Next, pick your industry. In our case, that's fashion. Once you've clicked Create Project, connect your Shopify store. That'll unlock all the real-time product info so we can pull in things like prices, photos, and variants directly into our landing page. Before you can start designing, Instant will prompt you to begin a seven-day free trial. You'll see a quick overview of what's included, full access to all templates, the drag-and-drop editor, and advanced styling tools. Just click on Start Free Trial, Add your PayPal or credit card details, then click Approve to confirm the plan inside your Shopify dashboard. Don't worry, you won't be charged during the trial and no payment is required up front. Once that's done, you'll land right inside the Instant Editor. And this is where everything starts to come together. On the left side of your screen, you'll see six main options. Landing pages for creating full, standalone pages designed to convert, Theme sections for reusable content blocks that can be added into your existing Shopify theme. Product pages if you want full control over how individual product pages look. Element presets, which are pre-built blocks like hero sections, testimonials, FAQs, and more. Collection pages to customize how groups of products are displayed. And navigations where you can build your own menus and navigation bars. This setup gives you full control over how every part of your store looks and functions whether you're starting fresh or just enhancing what you already have. Let's start with landing pages. This is where you'll find a huge selection of pre-designed templates. They're modern, mobile optimized, and totally customizable. Just hover over any template to preview how it looks. You'll also see a little grid icon on some. That means the layout uses Instant's flexible grid system, which is perfect if you want to move elements around freely instead of being stuck in rigid columns. I'll scroll down until I find one that feels clean and sleek, something that matches Cairo's modern aesthetic. This one here with the bold hero image and scroll animations looks perfect, so I'll hit Add Page. Instant will automatically load the template into the visual editor, and this is where things get fun. Everything here is editable, 
Just click on any element, text, images, buttons, and the settings panel opens up on the right. You can change content, colors, fonts, spacing, layout, all without ever touching a line of code. And here's where the grid system really shines. I can grab this image block and drag it anywhere on the page. It's that simple. So let's start customizing this layout for Cairo. I'll swap out the hero image with one of our product shots. To swap the image, just click on it. Then, head over to the right panel. Under the image field, you can either upload your own file or pull one directly from your Shopify product library. Just switch to the Shopify tab and select the product image you want to use. Next, I'll change the headline to something that fits our brand. Let's go with Time Reimagined. And underneath a subheading like Minimal Design, Maximum Presence, Meet Cairo. Then, we've got a call to action button. I'll link it to our best selling product page and change the text to Shop the Collection. Already, this is starting to feel like a polished landing page. Now let's scroll down to the Features section. These are perfect for highlighting what makes Cairo watches stand out. To update the Features section, just click on any of the icons. Then, look over to the right side of the editor. Click on this field under Icon. You can either keep the existing icon or choose a new one from the built-in library. Like a stopwatch for precision quartz movement, a feather icon for lightweight comfort, and a droplet for water-resistant design. We can also leave some icons as is and just edit the text. You want to showcase the value fast and make it easy for customers to see why your product's different. Next up, let's add a product gallery to highlight our best sellers. To do this, click on the plus icon on the left side of the editor. Go to theme sections and browse through until you find a layout that fits. Once you've added it, you can move the section around by simply dragging it to a new position on the page. If there are any default sections you don't need, just right-click on them and select Delete to keep things tidy. Once the section is in place, click onto a card and look at the top right corner. You'll see the option to switch between Placeholder and Shopify. Go ahead and select Shopify, then click Select Source to pull in product or collection data directly from your store. From here, you can choose to pull content from either your products or collections. I'll choose products and then select one of our watches. You'll notice the product appears in the section, but some of the details like the image and text haven't updated yet. That's because we still need to tell the app to use Shopify data for each field. So let's start with the product image. Click on it, scroll down the settings panel on the right and click on the field under image. Then choose the Shopify tab. This will automatically pull the product image from your Shopify store. Now do the same for the title. Click on the text block, scroll down, click the database icon, and set the source to title. You'll see it update in real time, pulled directly from your store's product page. I also want to integrate the price, so let's copy that same text block, paste it right below, and repeat the same steps. But this time, choose price as the source instead of title. This way, both your product name and price stay synced with your Shopify store. If you want to change the background color of any card, just click on it. Scroll down on the right-hand panel, go to Fill, and select the color that fits your brand. This method keeps everything synced and saves time, especially useful when you're updating or swapping out products later. Just repeat the same process for each product card to make sure all the details pull through from your Shopify store. Let's keep going and drop in a comparison chart. These are great if your collection has multiple tiers or styles. I'll add a new section from the Instant Library and set it up like this. Cairo Verge versus Standard Watch Brands. Then I'll list out some key differences. These little touch points help boost credibility and guide buying decisions. Moving on, let's add a Reviews section. You can use a pre-built layout from the library or build your own with a few quote blocks and star ratings. Here are a few customer highlights we'll feature. Feels way more expensive than it is. The finish is stunning. Already got compliments. Lightweight, sleek, and doesn't scratch. I'm obsessed. 
wore it to an event and got asked where I bought it. Twice. To edit these, just click on each section, quotes, stars, text, and make your changes directly in the editor. Next, let's add a Frequently Asked Questions section to handle common customer questions. This helps reduce hesitation and builds trust before purchase. You can use a pre-made layout from the Instant Library or build one manually using collapsible text blocks. Once the section is in place, just click on each question to edit the text and then do the same for the answers. Some sample FAQs will include are is the watch waterproof or water resistant? Do you ship worldwide? What's your return and exchange policy? How long does the battery typically last? What kind of warranty do you offer? And again, all you need to do is click on each block and make your changes in the editor. You can also adjust the font, spacing, and background color if you want it to feel more on-brand. Before you publish, let's quickly give your page a proper name. By default, it might just say page one which isn't very helpful if you plan on making more pages in the future. To rename it, head to the top left corner of the editor and click the gear icon. In the name field, type something like Cairo launch page or whatever makes sense for your project. Once you've renamed it, click publish in the top right. A pop-up will appear first. Click enable app embed in Shopify. A new tab will open where you'll activate the app embed. Just toggle it on, hit save, then head back to Instant and confirm that you've enabled the embed. Once that's done, your landing page is officially published. Just click View Page at the bottom to see it live, a fully branded, custom-designed showcase for your Cairo collection. This is seriously one of the easiest and most powerful ways to build high-converting product pages on Shopify. It's flexible, fast, and it looks like a designer made it, without you having to hire one. I love using pages like this to drive ad traffic, promote special launches, or send email subscribers to a focused buying experience. It helps cut distractions and really lets your product shine. Now, if you're new to Shopify or just starting out, there's one more thing I want to cover, and that's pricing. So before we wrap up, let's quickly go over Shopify's pricing plan so you know what to expect after the trial. First, there's the basic plan, starting at $19 a month when billed yearly. It's great for solo entrepreneurs. You get 10 inventory locations, 24 7 chat support, and in-person selling tools. Third-party card rates start at 2%, and you can try it for just $1 a month for the first three months. Next is the grow plan at $49 a month. It's ideal for small teams and includes five extra staff accounts, the same inventory and support, and lowers your card fees to 1%. Then we have the advanced plan, starting at $299 a month. This one's for scaling businesses. You get 15 staff accounts, local storefront support, and even lower payment fees, down to 0.6%. And finally, there's Shopify Plus at $2,300 a month, built for large, complex businesses with custom needs. No need to decide right away. You can explore all of this risk-free, with a three-month trial at ecomsensei.com slash Shopify. Now that your landing page is live, the next step is driving traffic to it because even the best landing page won't convert if no one sees it. That's why I put together a follow-up video walking you through how to get free, high-quality traffic to your Shopify store, no paid ads required. I'll drop that link in the description, so make sure to check it out after this. Thanks for watching, and good luck launching your brand with style.